Good morning. Happy Saturday, y'all. Welcome to the first day of the vlog. It is 9.30. I clearly just got out of the shower. We have a fun day today. Not like early on in the day, but this afternoon and into this evening, I'm doing something pretty fun with my nieces. So I thought that we could do a fun get ready with me later, help pick out an outfit. It's also 40, I think it was 43 degrees this morning and there's a freeze warning. I don't know what's happening, but it's going to be really cold tonight, so I need to dress warm. We're going to see a play, by the way. We'll talk about it later when we get ready. Um, but for now, I just showered. I'm going to clean the house a little bit. I have some work on the computer to do. My Stitch Fix video goes live today, so I need to do that. But also, Brian and I yesterday did a little bit of shopping, so let me show you a few things. I got these new sheets at Costco yesterday. How cute are they? They say like a microfiber, but they feel like those... Brooklyn and sheets that I got that I talked about a long time ago that we love, like those cooling sheets almost, but the print, this like ditzy floral, $19.99 for a king set. I think it was $16.99 for the queen. How cute are they? So I'm gonna wash them and put them on the bed. I'll link them down below for you. We also got this new trash can that you step on and it lifts. I won't show you everything in our trash can. Love it. So our old one here, was automatic like you could wave your hand in front of it and it broke a long time ago and we couldn't like repl replace the battery whatever we couldn't figure out how to fix it so we just got a new one is this a costco haul okay we also picked this up i thought it was really cool it's a light with a bunch of different settings but also it's bluetooth so you can play music you can also do like outdoor nature sounds and i thought this was really cute because we have a radio towards the front like where the back door is where you can sit and eat but in the way back where the pergola is we don't have anything so i thought this could be fun to sit back there when we're having pool parties and stuff i am loving my hair, I got it done last week with y'all. Um, we did not do the root smudge, so we went all the way to the root with the highlight, and I got the brighter in the front again. That just makes it feel more bright. I think we are gonna do a little bit of Ulta shopping before we go to the play tonight as well. So that's probably something I'll take y'all to do. I love this, <laughs> this dry bar brush, but I've had it for years and years, and I think it's time to retire and get a new one. Like I pull hair out of it all the time, but I feel like it's just, it's time to get a new one. So we'll do a little bit of Ulta shopping with my nieces. They picked Mexican food for dinner. So that should be fun. Here's my hair wet. You know when you can see the blonde wet, it's going to be good when it's dry. It's going to be super bright. I got like soap, uh, face wash, I mean, in my eye this morning. All right. I also started reading a new book, which is pretty good. So I want to try to squeeze in some time for that. I also started reusing this. Oh, excuse you. I also started reusing this. Again, the Kerastase. It helps with hair growth, but not like you've got to, I think you've got to have hair there, like hair thinness, and it helps to like thicken it up a little bit. So I used this one years ago. I talked about it and we liked it. I also bought this one and I don't think I ever even used it. Look, it's dusty. The Rena Resistance line, this color product. I really like all these products, this color at uh, Kerastase. Let's see, serum, scalp and hair serum for hair seeking healthy length. Strengthens and fortifies hair for reduced breakage. That's probably what I should be using. Let's see, this one says leave in scalp and hair concentrate for external use only. That's all it says. It doesn't tell me exactly what it does, but I had good luck with this. Like the thinning around my face when I had it bleached years ago and it ruined my hair, this helped. But I think we're gonna go with this one because my hair's in pretty good shape, it's just that breakage. Why are we starting off with just chatty Taryn? So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put some in here and I'm gonna just ooh, ooh, put it here. I think you're supposed to use like one or like a quarter of a pump or something like that, but I have a lot of hair, so. I just use a little bit more than what the average like amount of hair person would use. I've been using the gold one, by the way, but I have this one and I wanna use it. So we're gonna do that. We're gonna let the sit, blow dry, read a little bit, do a little bit of housework, and I'll see you tonight or this afternoon, probably around like 3, 3.30 when we go to get ready for the play tonight. <gasps> Y'all, these are the softest sheets. Oh my gosh. 
It even came with four of the king size pillowcases. Yeah, highly recommend. So soft. My pillows are like queen length pillows, so these don't fit on mine. So I'm washing my other ones I was using, but how cute. So soft. Welcome back. It is now about five o'clock. I'm trying to put an outfit together. So these are the boots that I wanted to wear. They're from Walmart. They're super cute, like slouchy, cowboyish looking boots. My problem, well, not my problem. I like that it's chilly outside so that I can wear the boots. It's the rest of the outfit <laughs> that I'm having a hard time with. This top from Maurice's, which I got from Poshmark. And then these are those Walmart Sophia Vigaria. I think they're called the Melissa Poulon jean. So cute, right? So comfortable. I'm gonna put on some thick socks for the boots and then I'll show you the jacket that I wanna wear. Okay, boots on. They're very comfortable, by the way. Okay, jacket. This one from Maurice's that I got a while ago. I've never even worn it. Oh, I just whipped that whole thing off. Dang, what does that tag say? Due to the special dyes Oh, loss of color after laundering. Okay, that's fine. We're not worried about that. I'm really trying to get this sticker off and we might just be wearing it. There we go. I'm not running late per se. I just need to leave here by 5.15 at the latest. I also wish that I would have straightened my hair, but here we are. Okay, this is the look. I need to go look in a big mirror. Okay, I'll be right back. Let me look in a mirror and then we'll pick out some jewelry. All right, outfit looks good. I'm gonna do these earrings. From Target. I've never worn them, but I think they're cute. I was searching my closet for a white blouse I thought would be cuter, but all I have are like white tees. Like, I don't think they're, I mean, I guess a white tee could be cute, but I just felt like this was the next best option. Earrings in. I need to put my wedding ring on, spray a little bit of perfume. I walked right into that. And here's the full outfit. Very comfortable. These jeans are pull-on jeans. You literally can't beat them. So comfy. My sock is falling in my boot, so I need to pick it up or like pull it up before we go. But here we go. This is the full look. So tonight we're going to see a play called Into the Woods. It's put on by like a local theater group. I think my nieces said one of their friends at school is in it. So it should be fun. Fun fact. Are you ready for this story? Did I tell this story already? When I was younger, I swore to all things that I was going to be some sort of famous performer, like singer. I really thought I was going to be the next Britney Spears. Okay. So there's this theater in town. I think it's called the Joe Jefferson Players. We're not going there tonight. We're going to the Pact Theater. Um, but anyway, Joe Jefferson, and they were doing auditions for, I don't even know what play. And I begged my mom to take me. So we show up to this theater, we sign in, and as people are like going up there and doing whatever it is that they prepared to perform, I realize I didn't think this through and I don't have anything to sing. So I get up there. Do you want to know what I did? I, I said, do, re, mi, fa, so, la, ti, do. Can you tell? I can't sing at all. Like there's no nothing in me that can carry a tune and my mom said she was in the back like <laughs> so there was my one shot at fame <laughs> they didn't call me needless to say but I did that I was in a movie one time in town they filmed I think it's called hometown legend hometown hero some football movie they filmed it over in like Robertsdale I think um, and they were looking for extras and me and my mom and my friend Becky, I think it was like signed up for it and they called us and we went and we were like extras in this movie. I've never actually watched the movie. I'm pretty sure it was like a straight to DVD kind of thing, but I did buy it on Amazon probably like five years ago because I was like, I need a copy of this movie that I was in and I still haven't watched it to this day. I need to watch it and see. I remember I borrowed uh, Timberlands from one of my friends because those were like so popular and I felt so cool in my Timberlands. I need to find that clip so that I can watch it. But anyway, there we go. So I'm here. It looks a little bit crowded. So I'm gonna go check 
and like put our name on the list. I did put this ring on. Brian gave me that. It actually has a matching necklace, but I felt like my earrings are gold, so I didn't do the necklace. And then I put my wedding band on. So I'm still adjusting to my hair. I feel like it's very blonde. Last vlog, we got it done together. Yeah, I, I wish I would have straightened my hair. Anyway, we're at San Miguel having Mexican. My niece's choice. My mom's meeting us. And then we're going to go to Ulta, so I'll see you in a little bit. Okay, Mexican food secured. It was good. Now we're going to go into Ulta, get a couple things. I'm very happy with my outfit choice. These jeans, super comfy. Okay, we're running a few minutes behind. Checked out at Ulta. You saw that. The packed theater is where we're going. Hello again. Today is Monday. It's about 11.35. I am headed to my mom's to do a little bit of work. You can't see in the back, but I have the most beautiful dresses. I ordered, I'll link the video down below. I ordered a mystery box from Jessica K, that brand that sells like the whimsical dresses. They sell every single dress in sizes extra, extra small through 6X. They got me, but they were doing a mystery box. So I'll link that video down below. I filmed it this morning and she's gonna help me shoot some extra content. Uh oh, I think one of them may have fallen off back there. Um, she's gonna help me shoot some extra content, but let's rewind and talk about Saturday night. All right, first of all, that outfit, top tier, most comfortable. Those jeans stretched out just enough. Like they didn't get baggy, but they stretched out just enough. They were so comfortable paired with the boots. I'm so happy I wore that. Also the jacket, I don't know if you could tell, but it had like panels on the sides. So it was such a nice, like comfy outfit, but it looked so put together. So I'll try to find those pieces and link them down below for you. If I didn't say that already on Saturday, we had such a good time. The play was so good. It was long, which surprised me. Um, I think it started at 7.30 on the dot. We had one 15 minute intermission. And then I think we got out of there at 10.30 but it was good. Like everybody did such a good job. And come to find out one of the anchors that worked at a TV station here that I worked at for the longest time, his daughter was one of like the main people in it. I posted something on like my personal Facebook and they commented. So that's just cool. Um, so we had such a good time doing that. There was something else I was gonna mention. Oh, yesterday, Brian and I went to this new place called Big Bad Breakfast for breakfast. So good. I found chocolate covered bananas at Publix, not at not at the breakfast place, <laughs> like frozen ones. Uh, so we had such a fun time yesterday and today is back to work. So let's go meet with my mom. I'll show you some sneak peeks or some snippets, but please watch the video. I feel like you're gonna love it and the dresses are just fun and I had a fun time filming it. So here's our first spot, this beautiful church, but they have these really pretty arches here. The front doors are really pretty too, but this little spot we're gonna try first here. It might not work because you see the way the shadow is. Um, so we may go around to the front door, but this church, very pretty. My dress is this color. I have darker ones. So there's a cute little white church too we may try next. Okay, dress number one. Mm. How cute. Oh, just trying to get the full view. All right. Have fun. On to dress two. Location number two. I'm in a blue. They call it dusty blue dress. I liked the greenery. It's another church around the corner. Um, it's not as cute as the first one, but the greenery is nice and you can stand on the sidewalk, which is what I like. That's a wrap on dress two. I'm not going to show you anymore. I'm going to make you wait or you have to go click the link down below so that you can watch the video, but it's turning out really cute. The large ice blondie. No, no whip. Yep. Mm -hmm. And no whip. We're doing a nope. pop cup today. Just me. Thank you so much. Good morning. I'm getting a yellow hammer. Will I regret regret it? I don't know. I can't even talk. Um, I haven't had yellow hammer in a month and a half. I haven't had regular coffee, a whole regular coffee in the same amount of time. I don't know. I just felt like I wanted to I felt like I was drinking a lot of coffee. So I just like cut cold turkey. I even switched to caffeine-free Diet Coke. Um, I still kind of get headaches sometime and I think it's because of the lack of caffeine, but anyway. So we're gonna have a coffee today because 
it is deep clean day. I am tired of looking at all the nasty nooks and crannies in my house. Like to the naked eye, like when you're just, oh, hey, welcome to my house. And you look around, everything's straight. Everything looks fine. It's not fine, okay? It's not fine. So I am getting a coffee for that purpose. Today is going to be a long day of cleaning. Right now, I'm gonna run to Target. I do have a pickup for a pair of shoes, those black like Birkin, Birkenstock dupes that I have, one of my nieces really likes. So I got her a pair, and then I'm gonna get cleaning supplies. I don't wanna do it, but it's so bad, like it needs to be done. Y'all know I keep up every week with like the laundry and the, you know, cleaning the couches, like that kind of thing, but it's all the other stuff that just falls by the wayside. So I'm gonna do like wipe down all the walls, all the ceiling fans. We're gonna scrub toilets, tubs, mop, sweep, vacuum, all of the above. I did wanna bring up the Costco sheets. We've slept on, on them for three nights, I think it is now. I like them. I think they're very pretty. They can't beat the Brooklyn and sheets. I'm sorry, they just cannot. Those Brooklyn and sheets are like cooling sheets and I once you have those you almost can't go back to regular sheets if I hadn't had the Brooklyn ones the Costco ones would be like the best deal of my life and I would go and buy more but I'm gonna switch back to the other ones today wash the Costco sheets and keep them as a backup like if I had a guest bed like in a bedroom with a bed I would put them on there because they're so pretty I do think they're great gifts as well like if you know someone who's getting married or bought a house or something like that, or they're redoing their bedroom and they just want new sheets for their birthday or something, I think they're great. But they just, I can't get over the Brooklyn and sheets. So I'm gonna switch them all out today. There's my update on the Costco sheets. Okay, so I picked up the sandals and they were like stained with glitter and stuff. So I'm glad that I looked in the bag before I walked off. So I just did a refund on them and I'm gonna walk to the shoes and see if they have her size and then we'll continue on, which I could have done, yes. But the last time her and I were in here, they were all picked over. Like the black ones go so fast. Oh, I need a hand sanitizer. See, I get distracted so easy. We'll just take the Target brand. Looks like they're fully stocked on sandals. Okay, let's go down here. Let's see, I think she needs an eight. Yeah, why would they give me dirty ones when they have clean ones? I don't know why they all have glitter on them. <laughs> Not all of them, but of course, like the size that I need has just a little bit of glitter, which I think is probably fine. Maybe it's like warehouse stuff, I don't know. I'm headed to check out, but look at these pants. They're in the straight size section, so they're not gonna be in my size, but how cute for a summer pant. I actually see them over here. They also come in blue, hot pink, brown tan, or like striped pinstripe, and then they have one black. How cute are these? They're called the Fluid Trousers from A New Day. Let's see, they have sizes 16, 16 looks like the largest size over here. Let's see if it's accurate. Yeah. All right, well, those are very cute. I did switch out a couple things, but here's my final cart. I feel like it's gonna be pretty pricey. If that's not the perfect shot, I don't know what is. All right, so I spent a total of $158 even. I did have like $1.50 on my Target app that I used. And then I guess because I spent a certain amount of money, I got a $5 gift card. So, 158. 
which is quite a bit of money. They did have scented pretty litter, but I didn't get it. I got the original that we always get because I don't know if it's like, can mask cat urine and feces or you're at the beach with a litter box. You know what I mean? <laughs> I didn't know which one that was. So I just got the original, but now I'm going to head to the post office because it's just right there and then go home and clean for the day. I am not going to show you cleaning. I don't really enjoy watching cleaning videos and it's, you know, it's going to be like an all day thing. So that's my plan for the day is to clean. Oh, I did order some Walmart swimsuits today. So there's that. They should be in, I think it'll actually be up on Saturday. They'll be up in time to be up on Saturday. I picked some cute ones. I, I went safe with the brand that I knew, like brands I knew. So I'm excited for that. Walmart swimsuits. Last year, I was looking back to see when the last one I did was, I think it said 10 months ago. Mm, I might be making that up. Anyway, I ended up keeping one of the swimsuits and I still have it to this day. It was one that I kept and wore. Um, so I'm excited about that, but let's go clean. I'll see you later after hopefully my house is spick and span spotless. Good morning. I, everything hurts. My whole body hurts. Yesterday, that one coffee, I worked until probably 6 p.m. I had like three bites of a hamburger all day long. That's what I need to do from now on. Like whenever I want to clean something like that, I need to drink one of those coffees. And I was like in the best mood ever, like singing, dancing, cleaning until about probably like 5.30, I started to feel a little bit shaky. And I was like, you know what? Maybe I should eat something. So we bought some really good apples from Costco over the weekend. Well, I think it was Friday actually last week. Anyway, they were so good. So this morning I need to run and do some tax things pay the old government for this life I live. And then I'm gonna come home and I need to take these nails off. I ruined like this one, this one, and then this one. I wore gloves yesterday, but I guess I was just rough on them. Um, so I'm gonna take these off. I need to edit the vlog. I can't believe it's already Wednesday. I feel like that flew by. I thought about going back to Target because all those new cleaning supplies I bought I don't really have anywhere to put them. So like, where's that receipt? I just wrote down, is this it? No, I had a Target receipt. Anyway, I wrote down the measurements for under the sink in the kitchen to buy some sort of container to put them all in, but I don't think it's really gonna work because we have a garbage disposal and then the pipes. And then there's already um, something Brian installed that's like slim, but long on one corner that rolls out with supplies in it. So I don't know, I may go have a peak seas and just look, but first things first, I have to eat food. I am so freaking hungry. We ordered pizza last night. I feel like I barely ate anything. I was so tired. I just went straight to bed. So I'm gonna get something for breakfast. And then I'll probably see y'all at Target. I feel like we should go. And we're back at Target. I left the house this morning. It was 52 degrees. It is now 67 degrees in like less than an hour. I did wear bike shorts, but I'm wearing long sleeve top. Oh my gosh, how cute is that? Squeeze the day. I don't need that, I just bought one, but look how cute. Could we use it for the back porch? We're gonna put it in the buggy, just cause it's so cute. Okay, let's start on this aisle. Maybe I can just find something flat because like this is not gonna work. This might work, but then I'm not really gonna be able to see what's in the container, you know? Ooh, this is what I need, like this. Yeah, I didn't even bring a tape measure. Oh my gosh, okay. But not a lot can fit in that. So that's what it looks like. What do we think? I think I have more cleaning supplies than that. And that's all that would be able to fit back there. All right, so that's definitely not gonna work. I can only do eight inches wide before it hits some sort of poles or something. So this unfortunately is a no, but that would have been perfect. See, I could do something like this, but again, that's not, not a whole lot of stuff can fit in there. So let's keep it moving. Maybe we can find something more flat and long. How cute is that garbage can? Where's the lid though? Do they not have a matching lid for it? That is so cute. Okay, do we do something like this? 
It looks like they're stackable. Then what's the point? You know, I could just put it on the ground. But I guess it's all... I wish they made these with wheels so I could just kind of roll it out. I see this kind. But again, oh, that's kind of high anyways. They don't have the wheels on them. I think only the big ones sometimes have wheels on them. Something like this might be my best bet. But I don't really see the point. I can just set them on the bottom of the cabinet you know that's just a container to set them in so I guess we're gonna pass I don't see anything else that I think could work but I think I'm kind of messed up with the pipes and the garbage disposal I am gonna grab a couple of forks these aren't the exact ones that I've been looking for but they do seem really nice so I'm gonna grab these I don't think we really need like spoons, knives, or anything, but the forks we're gonna grab. Look how cute this Knox Rose dress is. I love the green color. How much is it? 35 bucks. Should we try it on? I wonder if the fitting rooms are open. Y'all know I'm on the hunt for a good dress for pictures as well. I don't know if the Jessica ones are gonna work. <laughs> I'm not confident enough yet to decide that, but I did want like a maxi length something so maybe one of these could be pretty they are sunset pictures so I kind of wanted something bright not that not that <laughs> um, that blue one caught my attention but it's a little bit more tie-dye-ish than I want I like the ruffle at the bottom oh that's a jumpsuit that's pretty okay I thought I'd have more look like these white ones are pretty but not really what I'm going for for that. Okay, here we go. It's kind of cute. It's not as baggy as I thought it was gonna be, which I like. It's a little bit more fitted at the top probably because it's an extra, extra large, but I like the length. It has pockets. The color is really pretty. I'm still wearing bike shorts. It, it is a little bit, I guess it's really not that short for summertime. Okay. I did bring another one in too. I've seen almost the exact same dress. Well, what looks like the exact same dress anyways on Chic Soul's website. Um, they didn't have an extra, extra large. They just had an extra large, but it's got smocking and stuff. So we're going to try it on. Okay. It's cute too. It's very short. Like I think you could probably just wear shorts with it. It's tight in the chest too, but just regard the size, the style, it has pockets and the proper size would be cute. It is a little bit see-through, as you can see my black shorts, but I think it's a cute little summer dress, again, in the proper size. However, it's got a cutout. It's got this cutout back here. So, anyway. So we're saying no to this one, but it is an option. If you like this style and you were to save a little bit of money and be able to try on in store, but you liked the Chic Soul one, I'll link this one as well. Okay, we're gonna pass on both of the dresses, but that's okay. We'll keep looking. It is now about 73 degrees. It's so beautiful outside today. There was this bumblebee here. I guess it was alive. Hold on, let me show you. Well, I mean, I guess I have nothing to show you. Yesterday I was sitting in this chair where I always sit while Cash does her thing out here. And there was a dead bumblebee. It was huge, like right here. I even took close up pictures of it because I thought when else am I going to see a bumblebee like that close up? I come out here today and it's upside down, like trying to flip itself over. So I helped it. I even poured a little bit of water here because it was struggling. And I thought maybe the water will, will help. I guess it flew away. I don't see it on the ground. I don't see it in the chair because it was walking, you know, this way. And that's where the water was. So I guess it was alive. So I'm going to put this rug out. Those two rugs are from the, uh, our bathroom. I don't know how to clean them. I need to do a little bit of research because y'all know yesterday I deep cleaned. I feel it everywhere. <laughs> um, so I need to do a little bit of research on how to clean that kind of rug because it's got tons of my hair in it, dog hair, you know, do you just vacuum them? I don't know. So let's put this new rug out first. This is what is here currently. Listen, don't judge me, okay? It's gross over here. I guess I'm just gonna throw this one away. All right, actually, I'm gonna hose it down over there. Just, because it's really gross.
Look at Layla. <laughs> I'm gonna let this dry off a little bit before I put the rug down because it's sopping wet. But we actually had somebody come and measure this little section here. So from, see where the bricks kind of change pattern, all that to the wall, come and measure that from here. I hope y'all can see me clearly. I'm holding this kind of funny because my hands are wet. From here all the way to this fence where the pool pump is because Brian wants to put concrete here. Maybe this is better. Yeah, there we go. This whole section here, Brian wants to put concrete here and make that the grill. Like redo this little awning thing to come across the top to cover like a grill. And he wants to put a little sink in here where this little spigot thingy is. And then on the outside will be like a bar where you can sit at. So we may do that. It's, it's expensive, but we did have someone come and price it for us. This is our bathroom window. <laughs> um, so I'll let you know though, if we decide to do that. He said he'll probably end up doing it. It's the same company that did this concrete whenever we ended up doing that. So I'm gonna end you so I can edit you. I might sit out here at the pool. Like I probably won't put on a swimsuit, but maybe switch to like a sports bra. I'm just wearing Nike shorts and sit out here. I downloaded Audible. Did we talk about this already? I think maybe I only talked about it on Instagram. So I downloaded a free trial of Audible. I didn't really love it, so I canceled it so that I wouldn't be charged, but I have it until the end of the month. And I've been listening to a book and I really like it now. So let me know your favorite books. I had a lot of people tell me to do the library apps instead because they're free. So we might do that, but anyway, I hope you enjoyed this week's vlog. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Be sure to hit the subscribe button. I need to go in there and take these nails off. I'll see you on Saturday for a Walmart swimsuit video. And that's it. I'll see you then. Thanks for watching. Bye.